Leviosa. I wish. I might be Harry Potter, but I can't lift one book by myself. So, so I can take care of the Dark Lord, but I can't lift a book by myself. Oh dear. How embarrassing. Guardian Leviosa. Guy's about to die. Like some you look like you need a chocolate frog. <laughs> Go up through here. We should now be on top of the greenhouses, I believe. Yep. Uh, forget most of these areas for now. Uh, see where, where can we go? Go along here, can we? Yep, we can. Carpe retract him. Oh, oh, you absolute swine of a vampire boss! You just waited. What are you doing here? That's great. There we go. Beans are plenty. Never have too many beans. And I just hit a dragon statue. Thing. Where enough is that one? A vivicum! Stop off! It stunned me! Did I really just hit it all the way over there? That's impressive if I did. <laughs> Anyways, make our way along. A vivicus! Along around here should be. Come on, you two! No, I can't hit the one too well there. That's just no way, way. I'm sorry, but I, 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 I can't believe that I've done that. Have a look. There should be a shield up here, somewhere. But yeah, I hit the dragon statue somehow. If there's a shield. Well, that's just that's just silly. <laughs> How on earth did I hit that? That's well, yeah, yeah. I, I meant to do that. I did a, a well, a well-timed. Well aimed shot. I got that. Not really, but no, seriously. <laughs> I am so good, as one would say. I must say, this the Jinx Cascade thing for Harry does have the added benefit of creating a very nice magic show. <laughs> Lights, like flashing spells going everywhere. Which you gotta love, eh? Hurry up! Yeah guys, honestly, what are you like? I should just better press um Guys, so come on, come through. Now where is the bomb? There it is. I it's somewhere around here. It's the statue the beans. There we go, number eight. So where is that? There it is, under the tree. So yeah, if you, if you get a Jinx Cascade, I've asked another great way to do it because you just pretend by random things and eventually you get it. No, don't jinx them. We'll we get, get pus on, on us, oh, of course. Oh, it is down there, isn't it? There we go. And number five. So now we've got all five shovels. I just hit the pause menu to be sure. But level info. We've got all five dragon statues and the five shovels. Now, believe me, that vanishing card is going to be hell to get. But, you know, I'll persevere. As is one in the prefix bathroom, which I haven't got yet. But, you know, we'll wait for that. So now we're in this massive, amazing this room. is a jungle. Which is a jungle. Like. Yes. Professor Sprout certainly likes her plants. That's one way of thinking about it. You're suggesting something there, Miley. Something a bit rude about Professor Sprout and plants. I don't know what to think of that. That's a bit weird. Anyway, let's make our way up and around this amazing structure. I mean, they certainly are prepared, aren't they? They've got not, not, not just one little greenhouse, they've got loads. They've really expanded from like, the, the first second game. It's huge this place now. And all just for a little bit of jillyweed. You have to go right to the very end of the place. Oh my god, even more vampire monsters. One of those scenes where, where, where the game tries to scare you with giant vampire monsters. Stung me! Well, it, is a, it is a 7 plus after all for fear. You know, scary stuff. Vampire monsters are the stuff I might mezzo, to be honest. I'll probably have a dream tonight about like running away from the giant vampire monsters. Trying to cast Mimicus, but to no avail. It's gonna be horrible. I can see it happening right now. Well, the thing is, though, beans are high up here. All the beans just fall away from the top. You could probably jump down and be softened by a massive pile of beans. And yes, you guessed it. We have to go down as well at the end. Fun times ahead, indeed. This one next. And there's a shield there, which annoyingly we can't get yet. We have to now. Hey, isn't that the gillyweed? On top of the fountain. How typical, eh? Guardian Break the fountain of the cauldrons. I hope Professor Sprout's good at the repair spell. Oh, might need this. It's going to make a big mess. 
So the game's encouraging vandalism here, saying, oh yeah, 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 it's fine for you guys to, like, you know, just casually destroy a, a priceless fountain. Saying hurry up, maybe, for the fifth game where he was meant to destroy everything in Bumble's uh, office. I'm a bit, a bit sad that they, they left that out in the movie. Harry's golden moment of, like, uh, you know, oh my god, Herklings. Hell on earth has descended, oh my god! We just run. I mean, there were some other kinds. One just. One, one couldn't take seeing the Vayner, he just died on the spot. Right. Three wars. Ah, awkward camera angle. Let's run for it, I say. It's us being protecting. One guess here. Oh, good lord. This is just. Thank you. Chickens are much more comforting than blooming earthlings. Ah, even more of them! How on earth does a fountain, which is water, create a fire? Sorry, but that just boggles my mind beyond belief. Oh, yes, I am very well guessed. Right, now down here we should be able to. Time to cast a giant aqua raptor. Come on, guys, help me out here. I'm not fireman Sam, I can't put this all out by myself. There it is, a gillyweed, just fine. For some reason, I thought you had to get the gillyweed before getting the shield, so for ages I, was, I spent like running up to the gillyweed trying to collect it. But no, you meant to go for the shield first. And you'll then, you'll then get the gillyweed to finish the level. And how will they be ready for the second task? On. Should I put the rest of the fire out? Should I just shield? <laughs> That'd be a bit of a half assed effort, wouldn't it? You know what? The shield's there. I'm only about half the fire. I can do the rest. Ooh, there we go. And the shield is ours. Go team! <laughs> so now we have the gillyweed, and I'm gonna have a drink for that. That deserves a nice sip of. Standard water. Ah, stuff of dreams. Now task two is available and new moody challenges. Well, hey, um, so I suppose we could give those a try in a bit. Actually, no, I think I'll do more of herbology first because there's a lot to do still in herbology. Plus, also now that we have finished, um, you know, now that we finished, um. And, and got the Habibica spell, we can now go back to all the rest of the levels and get the last couple of shields, which is fantastic. Oh yeah, and I can confirm that you get no um, shields at all for finishing um, Moody Challenges. It's just for... Um, what's the word? What's the word? It's just for shiggles and for getting beans. But you know, I'll still persevere and try and get gold in each one. Because I think, I'm trying to think now, there's four more... Um, Shields available in um, Prefect's bathroom. One more in her um, thingamabob, um, Forbidden Forest. One more in Hogwarts exterior. And then, you know, I really can't remember how many we've got for um, for Apology to, to get now, I mean. I think about four or five. And then we've got probably about pff, 16 or 17 so far. So we're not really halfway through the game. Let's have a look, shall we? Info... 17! That's not too bad then, I suppose. So, nearly halfway. But most of the shields to get now aren't that difficult to get. But anyway, if I just quickly show you Tribes of Tars number 2, nine more Tribes of Shields to get to get the next location unlocked. Honestly, better get collecting then. Oh, what, what am I doing? It's time to buy some more cards, because we've got loads more unlocked now. Huzzah! Right, if I now get on to set 5, I think, because I think set 1, 2, 3, 4, yep, they were one locked. Right, ASIO first. Increase the power of Harry's ASIO, sounds good to me. <gasps> it's Fox! <sighs> Harry's just like, Fox, I summon you with ASIO! And Fox is just like, hell no. Can't you see I'm on my perch, bitch? Uh, Ricochet, is it Ricochet? Get a spell for a ricochet jinx. I'm hopefully I'm, I'm, I'm pronouncing that right because someone corrected me in the last video or a couple of videos back anyway. Um, another jinx style card. Yep, that will do. 
Mia's just like, what the hell is that? Dumbledore is like, this? That's my wand. I'll let you make what you will of that. <laughs> um, and finally, Magicus Extremos, or rather, Magicus Extremos! That's how you properly say it, you know. Dumbledore's just like, hell yeah, I'm awesome. And Moody's just like, I knew I should have gone for the beard. That beard look is totally in this season. It's just, it's, it's too cool. Right, so that's the three cards for Harry Hermione now. So I'm guessing they've all got three cards unlocked. <laughs> Otherwise they'd be a bit unfair on the, on the other member of the team. Perfect cast. It would be Hermione to get a perfect cast, wouldn't it? Increases. Only for a short time, no? I think for Hermione it'd be forever, wouldn't it? Honestly. Oh, Hermione's just like, I'm so worried. <laughs> Harry, you can't do that. And Harry's just like, but I'm Harry Potter. I'll let you decide what that issue's doing. Stamina. Oh, hey. Hermione needs stamina. <gasps> Oh my god, that's the best picture ever. <laughs> oh, seriously, Hermione's just like, oh dear, if she's ever played the game before, I bet she's probably incredibly embarrassed if, if she could see this picture. Oh dear. That hair look, the, the, the strand of hair across the face is brilliant. Right, Jinx. Oh, that's more like it. That's sexy, Hermione. Hermione in pink dress, dancing with nice Bulgarian man. You know, very, very affirmative. Right, now for one. Let's have a looky here. There we go. 100 for Jinx and Magic of Stream. What's a combo here? That's quite nice. Uh, yeah, I'll do. <laughs> One's just like, I can't talk to you, Harry. <laughs> I'm so nervous. It's then one stamina. Why not? Everyone needs a bit of stamina in their lives. <laughs> One's just like, Hermione, look at my face. And I'll look into the distance. And I was like, okay. I'll go for the stern look. You have one just like, yeah, I'm so moody. I'm so moody, I should have a mad eye. Uh, Magicos to Dreamos again. Go on then, why not? I never use it. <laughs> Party crowd is just like, hello guys. And Fleur and Dumbledore are like, oh my god, we've been caught. Caught doing what though? I'll let your naughty minds decide on that. I just said stuff. Anyway, quest cards. Might as well have a look at these bad boys. Um, I've got the spade. Of sh is it shovel? Yeah, shovel rather for Hogwarts exterior. And we've got a nice picture of Hogwarts Castle on a typical English day, so it's raining. Lovely. Although it's in Scotland, I think it's in Scotland actually, Hogwarts is. But yeah, it'll still be raining anyway, because yeah, it never stops raining here. Um, I've obviously got a couple more to unlock for Forbidden Forest and probably Prefect's Bathroom as well. Yeah, yeah, I thought so. So I've still got a fair bit to explore because it's like there's four more I can get in Prefect's bathroom in terms of shields. So there's probably still quite a few collectibles there as well. Um, Scroots. Damn it, I still used to get two Scroot cards. I hate getting these ones because I'm just terrible at casting against Scroot. Stunner, Scroot, and then Jinx of Inflatus. Doesn't sound too bad. Ducklethors. Stun, then Extinguish, and then cast Ducklethors. Oh, that sounds horrible. I'm going to have to practice in the forest because that one in Herbology was. Horrible. How rude, honestly. Anyway, that's all the cards now. I think we can get. Okay. I think that just about rounds off this part. In the next part, I shall continue with the wonderful level that is apology, getting more and more shields, because the next couple of parts is just going to be shields aplenty. <laughs> See you in the next part then.